Hi everyone, this is Miss Torres, and today we are moving on to 10.5 of our Go Math, which is identify, name, and describe a cone. So we are on the last of our four 3D shapes that we've learned about in this chapter. The first shape we learned about was our sphere. Then we learned about a cube, a cylinder, and lastly today we will learn about the cone. Okay, we're going to learn about the cone today. So what does a cone look like? How could you describe a cone? I want you to think about our, the terms that we've been using in this chapter. Flat surface and curve. Okay, so let's see what a cone has. Do you see any flat surfaces? Do you see any curves? All right, now a cone has one flat surface down here at the bottom. Okay, so this is something that you can set flat on a table, right? A flat surface is something that you can set there and it will stay straight. Now, if you also laid a cone on its side, we have a curve, right, around the cone that will allow the cone to roll. Now, if you have anything shaped like a cone to roll at home, you'll notice that when it rolls, it's not a perfect roll like the cylinder is. Why not? There's something that you see that's different than the cylinder. Remember, the cylinder has a flat surface at the top, right? And then it also has another flat surface at the bottom. Let me draw that a little bit better for you. Okay, now the difference between the cylinder here and the cone is that the cone has a point here at the top. Okay, so a cone has a flat surface, a curve, and a point. Let's move on. Okay, we've done this each lesson. This is the last time we'll be doing this again. So we have our shapes here at the side. Okay, and you're going to sort your shapes. Either it's a cone or not a cone. Now you should know the name of every shape that we talk about. So I want you to think of the first shape right here. What is that shape called? It's called a sphere, and we know a sphere is not a cone. Do you see a point on the sphere? I don't. The next one, what shape is this? This is a cube. Okay, we, ha we see flat surfaces, but we don't see a curve like the cone does. What is this shape? This is our cylinder, okay? It does have a curve like the cone does, but the cone has that special point at the top, not the cylinder. So we're gonna put this on not a cone side. Last but not least, what shape is this? We have found our cone. We see a flat surface, we see a curve and our point. Okay, let's move on. Now take a look at the red cone up at the top. Remember our describing words. Think about, does the cone have a flat surface? A curved surface? Hmm, what do you think? Okay, number one, does the cone have a flat surface? Remember at the bottom here, we have a circle flat surface. So yes, a cone does have a flat surface. It's If you see in this cone right now, it is sitting, right, and standing right up straight, so it is flat at the bottom. Also, does our cone have a curved surface? 
Yes, it does. Remember I said that if you put it on its side, it would roll. We do have our curve. We do have our curve in our cone, so we're going to circle curved surface. A cone has both a flat surface and a curved surface. But number two, looking at the green cone with the handle on it, how many flat surfaces does a cone have? Hmm. What do you think? A cone only has one flat surface. The cylinder has two, but a cone only has one flat surface. This one up here, it's a pointy top. It's not a flat surface. Next page. Here we are with our real life shapes. You are going to point to the cones. Okay, where are you going to find the cones? There are only two this time. Okay, so let's start with the top row. Do you see any, co any cones? If you do, point to it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Here's the cone that you should have pointed to, right? That flat surface and the point. The middle row. Looks like we have a can a party hat, and a globe. Which one of those is a cone? Point to it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Here it is. The birthday hat is our cone shape. At the bottom. Looks like we have a gift wrapped in a box. We have a baseball and a book want you to point to the cone. Do you see a cone? Four, three, two, and one. Tricked ya. There are no cones. We have a cube, a sphere, and another cube-like shaped. There are no cones in this picture. So the two cones that you should have seen are the one at the top in blue and the one in the middle, the party hat in red. Let's move on to the last page. This is something that I added for this lesson to keep the lessons pretty similar. So on the first one at the top, you have two shapes and you're going to listen for my clue and you're going to point to the right shape that matches the clue. Hint number one. I have a flat surface. Hmm. When you think you know, point to the shape. Hint number two. I have a curved surface. Now you're looking for the shape that has both a flat surface and a curved surface. Go ahead and point to what you think is the right shape. Five, four, three, two, and one. And the right shape is this one. The cone has a flat surface and it also has a curve. Unlike this cube here, it's got a lot of flat surfaces, but no curve. Now, down at the bottom, I want you to draw something that you can think of in real life shaped like a cone. I'll give you a hint. It's called a cone. And something very yummy goes on top of that cone. We can think of an ice cream cone as a cone. It does have somewhat of a flat surface even though there is an opening at the top. A curve and a point at the bottom. Now my favorite ice cream is mint chips so I'm going to draw a picture of my mint chip sitting on my ice cream cone. If you have a paper or pencil at home, you can also draw your ice cream cone. 
And here's my chocolate chips. Now, thinking of another shape like a cone, this is something that you wear at a birthday party, right? A birthday hat is also shaped like a cone. So I'm going to draw this one on my head. So let me draw my head here. This is my quick drawing with my eyes, my mouth. Can't forget my eyebrows, <laughs> my nose. And I'm going to draw a green party hat on top of my head. I have my flat surface here. It goes up to the top. And there's my party hat. Let me give it some dots, even some stripes. And there is my party hat. Can't forget my hair. All right, now you can try to see if you can find anything in your house shaped like a cone. Hmm. Remember, cones have a flat surface, a curved surface, and a point at the top. And that is the last of the four 3D shapes. Remember, we had a sphere, a cube, a cylinder, and a cone. Thank you for watching.